What are test tube babies? Do you think test tube babies are born inside a test tube? No, it's just a myth. Test tube babies are a solution for women having complications in producing a child due to blocked fallopian tubes. Due to this blockage, the sperms cannot reach the egg for fertilization. Such women can have babies by using the in vitro fertilization technique or IVF. In this technique, fertilization of an egg with sperm is carried out in a glass dish or a glass tube rather than in the body of a woman. As the child is conceived outside the woman's body, the term test tube baby has been introduced. In 1978, Louise Brown became the world's first test tube baby to be born by in vitro fertilization. Now, how do you make a baby in a lab? In patients undergoing IVF, doctors overstimulate the ovaries by injecting them with hormones to produce multiple mature eggs. These eggs are collected in a petri dish and then the sperms are introduced. Sometimes the sperms are injected directly inside the egg. The sperms fertilize the eggs and form a zygote. The zygote is allowed to develop for about a week to form an embryo. The cultured embryo is then introduced into the mother's uterus for implantation. If the embryo gets implanted successfully, then it develops in the mother's uterus like all the normal babies do. Today, 6 million babies like Louis Brown have been born from IVF and have had normal healthy lives. Here is what we have learned. 